Well, homeowners aren't the only ones displaced by the fires. Animals and pets are evacuating to safer ground as flames tear through their normal habitats. One of our own CBS 13 photojournalist, Dave Grasshoff, stumbled upon some goats, pigs, and horses today while out covering the newly named North Complex West Zone fire in Butte County. Yeah, Dave has seen it all. New at 5, CBS 13's Adrian Moore with the rescues made thanks to his sharp eye. An apocalyptic scene, air heavy with smoke and ash, suffocating what's left of this Berry Creek neighborhood. But if you look close enough, come on, signs of life are peeking through the haze. <laughs> this dehydrated pig, spotted by CBS 13 photojournalist Dave Grassoff, who called for help. Moments later, a deputy with the Nevada County Sheriff's Office delivers some desperately needed water. It's tough. I mean, it, this breaks your heart from the devastation. It's eerily reminiscent of the campfire, which I worked uh, two years ago. Once animal service officers move in, they quickly realize they'll need more muscle. So you want, you want me to grab both the hind legs? That's our photojournalist jumping in again to help move the pig and load it into a truck so it can be nursed back to health. <laughs> Two goats also saved from this property while horses down the road await a similar rescue. These remaining empty pens assign homeowners may have tried to free their animals in hopes they could escape the fast moving inferno. It's a gut wrenching reminder that coping with disaster isn't exclusive to humans, but their four legged family members, too. I ran into Dave as he was leaving the parking lot. He said, What a day, just the devastation there. Mm -hmm. You know, the, the flames are gone, but just yeah. the impact, right? Yeah, hard to see. Human and animal. It's unclear if the animals, by the way, today uh, were injured or just thirsty and hungry. The hope is now that the animal service officers can reunite them with their owners and soon. So we'll hope to have a yeah. good follow up with that.